Hi everyone! So I thought I'd do a little bit of a video blog on what I have in my handbag. Uh, so at the moment I've been using the Celine Trio. This is the regular size um, and it's part of my 30 for 30 capsule wardrobe. Um, it's got three little pouches, they zip up so it means that you can keep all your different items in um, separate compartments and it's got a quite a long strap and it's adjustable so you can kind of change it to the length that you like. Uh, I really like using this bag just because if I use a really large bag I tend to put a lot in there and I lose absolutely everything so this for me is quite a good go-to everyday bag. So let's take a little look inside. In the first pocket I keep my wallet and my phone. So my phone has this really cute Fifi La Pan case on the front. It's a little bit cracked. I managed to fall on it while I was running. I tripped over my own feet and I landed on my phone. I got up, I didn't even think twice about all the scrapes on my on my arms and on my legs. I just looked at my phone and I saw, oh god, I've cracked my phone. Thankfully I've got one of those plastic covers over the top which I think sort of saved it from getting too damaged. Then I've got a little Deadly Ponies card holder. So this has got a little zip. I keep my PO box key in here. And then I've got all my things like my driver's license, my Opal card, you know, Medicare card, that kind of thing. I've got this really cute little Karen Walker coin purse. So it's navy on one side, turquoise on the other. And this just keeps all my coins, all of my notes in there. And it's got this really fun polka dot lining inside. I actually used to have a lean wallet. It was the medium or small size, so it would fit in here quite nicely. I think it was maybe that long, but I found that I was becoming a bit too precious with it. It was this taupe color, which meant that if I put it in my Madewell tote, it would get stained. Uh, so I tended to use these instead just because I didn't want to damage it. In the end I just thought this is working for me, I'm going to get rid of this lean wallet. So I ended up selling it on eBay. Um, now the second pouch, it has got some almonds in it. I'm always with snacks, I always have snacks on me. Um, and I tend to prefer to go for things like dried fruits and dried nuts, otherwise I'll get those little health bars. Um, I've been getting a lot of almonds at the moment, especially raw almonds, just because I like the taste and because they're packed full of protein, they keep me full. Then I've got my keys, which have a Sailor Jupiter key chain on them. Uh, I used to watch Sailor Moon a lot as a kid, and I collected all the dolls and everything, and I'm pretty sure on one of my hard drives I've got the entire series, so it's just one of those things. So I really like this. It's a little bit dorky, but it reminds me of my childhood. It's a bit nostalgic. I've got a compact mirror. My headphones. If I'm not reading on the way to work, I'm usually listening to music or I'll go on YouTube and watch some videos or that kind of thing. Now I've got a few different lip products. I tend to have different products in each of my bags. So in this one I've got a Blistex lip conditioner which is great. I'm actually almost finished with this. Um, I've only had it for a few months so I'm going to have to buy some more. Uh, I've got, I think this is Clinique, the Color Sensational Lipstick in Wild Rose. So it's this really bright pink color. I really like this for summer. I mean I think it's fun. It's a bit different from what I would usually go for and it looks really good if you've got a bit of a tan which I seem to have at the moment from all the sun I've been getting. Then I also have this Dior Addict Lip Glow. So this sort of changes colour slightly depending on the natural tones of your lips. Then I've got a few other useful bits and pieces. I've got some Panadol, which I don't ever really use. But it comes in handy if I've got a really terrible headache or if someone else has a really terrible headache. Um, I tend to use these a lot more. Band-Aids, I'm always getting blisters, always. I think it's just all the walking. Um, and then I've got my security pass work, which I also always seem to be forgetting. It's always in another bag or I lose it or something. So, yeah. Then in the final pocket, I've got my Moleskine diary. Uh, this is the small version. I don't use it as much as I should. So it's got... Seven, seven days over two pages. That's quite nice because it fits into all of my smaller handbags. I've got some Aesop 
resurrection hand balm so I like using this mostly in the winter time when your skin gets a little bit drier but it's just got the most beautiful orange scent so I've been putting this back in my bag again because I've forgotten about it for a little while and then I've got a pen so that's pretty much it it's empty now well aside from some receipts but um, yeah, so it fits a lot more than you would really expect. I um, think I can also get a pair of sunglasses in here as well, but the weather was a bit iffy this morning, so I didn't really bring those with me. Uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed getting a little sneak peek into what I carry in my handbag most days, and thank you so much for watching. See you later. Bye.